last three and a half weeks, uh, the highlight of the evening is about to go downhill. So if you haven't started drinking, I encourage you to do it right now. Because we're going to sing a couple songs for you tonight. And um, we like to think that when we started, it was a little rough. It's gotten a little better. But we're not quite sure. I, I have to tell you that, as I've said from the beginning, we are honored to be here. So, I know that we are looking forward to getting home and sharing our tour, our exploits, and this amazing journey of a lifetime with our loved ones. We don't want to leave. I know that for a fact. And it seems just like yesterday that we just blew in from the USA. It's chilly here, I have to say. But Scotland, here we are to play, curling without our choosers. But the wind blow high, the wind blow low, the curling cheers, and the notes will go. And all the lassies say, hello, Yankees, where's your choosers? Each day he drags our crap around, over hill and dale our buses bound. He's the best damn driver, pound for pound. Kevin and David, where's your choosers? We got a guy whose name is Hugh, he's the best damn courier he ever knew. Without him, we wouldn't have a clue. Huey, where's your choosers? Our courier, Robert, is simply great. He's made our tour absolutely first rate. He's now our lifelong curling mate. Robert, where's your choosers? Now, my name's Russ, and we've got Russ Brown. We hail from that windy Chicago town. Put up a card. <laughs> <laughs> Out from Ohio, that means Great River, don't you know? He cannot swim, but on the ice he'll go. Dougie, where's your choosers? Next up is Dennis Jorgensen from Minnesota D again. He'll take out a rocket, but you never know when. Dennis, where's your choosers? Let the wind blow high, let the wind blow low, and the girly sheets and the bills will go. All the lassies say, hello, Yankees, where's your choosers? Oh, from Detroit Way, first curling club in the USA. Now Yankee curling's here to stay. Paulie, where's your choosers? Slide in to make a toast from the North Carolina coast. Dick McCartney's here to salute our host. Dickie, where's your choosers? Jim Pleasants is a Seattleite. Curling out west, he's out of sight. Just one wee gram, he'll let the broom all night. Jimmy, where's your choosers? Let the wind blow high, let the wind blow low, and the curly sheets and the gills will go. All the lassies say hello. Yankees, where's your choosers? Mark Swanby, Captain Team USA from Madison, Wisconsin way. He let us out each day to play. Captain, where's your choosers? Now the last of the Wisconsin clan are David, Rich, Bill, Bob, and Dan. They hail from our Bonnie Dairyland. Dairylanders, where's your choosers? The Boston crew don't make a fuss. There's Herb and Bob and another Russ. Should they miss the broom, they never cuss. New England, where's your choosers? Let the wind blow high, let the wind blow low, when curly sheets and the hills will go. All the lassies say hello, Yankees, where's your choosers? Chris and John, the North Dakota pack, they're raring to go right out of the hack. They release their stone with a skillful neck. North Dakota, where's your choosers? David Peck is Rocky Mountain High. That's right, he's our Colorado curling guy. He'll sweep a stone to the Isle of sky. David, where's your choosers? Last stop is Carl from New York State, one heck of a Scott tour curling mate. But he drank his weight in scotch. <laughs> <laughs> Carl, come on up, where's your choosers? Let the wind blow high, the wind blow low, the curling cheeks and the hands will go. All the lassies say hello, Yankees, where's your choosers? Now from all these states we gladly came with sportsmanship our goodly aim. Let's toast the Scott tour in the roaring game. Scotland, where's your choosers? Let the wind blow high, the wind blow low, the curly sheets and the gills will go. All the lassies say hello, Yankees, where's your choosers? We can't thank you enough, Team USA. Thank you for having us. Thank you. We love you. We love you. It has changed our lives in ways that we will not know for days and weeks and years to come. I can promise you that. Russ Lemke would like to tell you a true story. This is a true story, and actually it happened uh, just across the north channel of the Irish Sea over in County Down. And there was old Muldoon, and he had his old dog Buddy. And Muldoon and Dougie, the Buddy, had been together for a long, long time. But it was clear that Buddy was getting up in years even more than old Muldoon. And finally one day, Buddy passed away. So old Muldoon went over to Father O'Malley, and he said, Father, Old Buddy has died on me here. I would really appreciate it if you would give Buddy last rites. And Father O'Malley said, well, the Catholic Church does not give dogs last rites. I suggest you check over here with this Presbyterian Church that's down the way. 
So Muldoon said, well, I think I'll do that, but let me, I've asked for a little bit of guidance. Do you think that 4,000 pounds would be too much or not, enough for <coughs> to, to provide last rites for the dog? And Walter O'Malley said, Jesus, Lord, Mother of God, I had no idea the dog was Catholic. <laughs> Now the Scotsman woke to nature's call and stumbled towards a tree. 
Behind the bush he lifts his guilt and gawks at what he sees. Then in a startled voice he says to what's before his eyes, Lad, I don't know where you've been, but I see you won first prize. <laughs> ring, ding, diddle, 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 ring, da, diddle, diddle, Lad, I don't know where you've been, but I see you won first song to sing for you tonight, and, and I've been saying that for about three weeks. One last song, and uh, it's kind of emotional, uh, I think, uh, for us to sing this one last time. Um, I started writing these words about six months ago to Highland Cathedral, and I fell in love with the song, and I, and I don't think anybody else really knew the tune from the U.S., and as we've sung it over the weeks, uh, I think they will all tell you we've kind of, all kind of fallen in love with the song. Um, when I was working on it, uh, somebody had asked me, well, why are you, you know, why are you going on an American tour? Why are you singing a Scottish song? And I corrected him, and I said, we're going on a friendship tour. And actually, this song was written by two Germans as a gift to the Scots, right? <coughs> our words and our singing is a gift to you, our friends, uh, that we've uh, met on our tour, lifelong friends, um, as a dedication of this tour to you. So... We're going to give it one last shot. <coughs> so guys, one last time. Slow and sweet. Um, bum, bum. Game of true sportsman, it will always be A grace that prevails since 16th century Play with much pride and camaraderie Curling the game from Highlands Bonnie. 1952 was when the tour began. America and Scotland in this game so grand. Hosted with honor in each other's land. A bond that will deepen with each shape in hand. Friendships are kindled both old and new. Goodwill in our hearts always remain. Spirit of curling, be strong and true till we visit these shores again. Boom, boom, boom. Rise, brethren, curlers, let your voices ring in this island cathedral of our game curling. Yeah. 